Number 1. Salivary glands produce saliva which keep mouth wet. Number 2. Saliva contains enzyme tylen, which help in digestion of carbohydrates in mouth. Number 4. Esophagus is a long tube open into stomach. Number 3. Stomach is thick wall, sac-like structure. Number 5. Wall of stomach secretes HCL and enzyme pepsin which help in digestion of protein. Number 6. Small intestine is long, narrow and coiled tube, 6 to 8 meters long. Number 7. First part of small intestine is called duodenum which is 30 centimeters long. Here digestive juices from liver, pancreas meet to the semi-digested food. Number 8. Second part of small intestine called jejunum. Number 9. Last part is called ileum, having finger-like projections present called villi. Number 10. The digested food is absorbed into the blood in the small intestine. Number 11. Villi absorb nutrients and enter them to blood. Number 12. In large intestine, undigested food is stored. Number 13. Water is reabsorbed and waste removed through anus. Number 14. Vitamin K is synthesized in large intestine by useful bacteria. Number 15. Appendix is not involved in digestion. Number 16. Liver secretes bile and emulsifies fats. Number 17. Pancreas produces pancreatic juice help in digestion of lipid, protein and carbohydrates. Number 18. The mechanical breakdown of food occurs in the mouth and stomach. Number 19. Breakdown of food mechanically done by stomach and teeth also called physical digestion. Number 20. Chemically digestion done by different enzymes. Number 21. Larynx also called sound box. Number 22. Upper part of trachea is connected with pharynx through an opening called glottis. Number 23. A cartilaginous flap cover glottis called epiglottis. Number 24. During swallowing. Glottis is covered by epiglottis while during inhalation it remains open. Number 25. In thoracic cavity, trachea divides into two bronchus.